biscuit when you come here you have to get the jam because without the jam the biscuits they're not they're not going to survive they're too dry okay it's going to go your throat is not going to survive that biscuit going to hit your throat and you're going to start choking okay worse than popeye's biscuits <laughs> Morning, kings and queens. It's your boy Los, Rusty Los. I'm back with another vlog, and today we are at Maple Street. What is Maple Street Biscuits? It's called Maple Street Biscuit Company. Thank you, Ethan. Do me a favor, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button because you're gonna like the vlog. I'm here with the family. We're gonna check this place out. Shout out to Deb because she recommended this place a year ago. And then shout out to Andy. He recommended it uh, like a week ago. And I said, we got to go. And Deb was like, well, I already, I already told you about it. And I said, well, Andy just told me about it, so we're going to go. So we're at Maple Street Biscuit Company. It looks like it's packed. Pack, pack, pack. So it must be good. Let's check it out. Maple Street Biscuit Company here in beautiful Pembroke Pines, Florida. Beautiful Pembroke Pines, Florida. All right, let's check it out, yo. Wow, lines to the door. Holy oh, smokes. As you guys can see, Something new to swap about. Biscuits that wow. Biscuits and gravy. Wow, there's a lot on here, guys, so I can't read everything to you guys. But as you can see, it's a full menu here with many different options. Look at the side, the side options potatoes, three layer cake, potatoes, sweet potato fries. Wow. Here's the back of the menu. Fresh squeeze oranges. Okay, so these are the drinks. These are the drinks on the back side of the menu. Okay, so this place is jam packed. It must be good. If you were here, what would you order on the menu if you were here? I don't know what I'm going to get. Wow. Maybe the farmer. I don't know. So good. And I won't keep the time. A few moments later. And so we got our food. So you order your food up there. Okay. And then you wait and you pick it up right over there. Okay. So Ethan got mm. some chicken and waffles. Yeah. Mommy got a chicken biscuit with some uh, hash browns. And I got waffles with whipped cream and strawberries. And I got the five and dive, which is a biscuit, uh, fried egg, uh, cheese, bacon, uh, fried uh, chicken breast, I think. And then another biscuit on the bottom uh, with the freshly squeezed OJ. Oh, so, as you can see, Everything came up to $65.81. It's very busy in here. It is very loud. And I'm looking forward to trying my food. So for my first bite, guys, I'm just gonna dive in right on the corner here. Get a little bit of that biscuit gravy, a little bit of that fried egg, just to, just to see what we're working with. Just get a little sample. See what we're working here. Sweating, yo. Wow, that gravy. Wow, that's... Mm. Guys, that's the sausage gravy. And it's got a kick to it, boy, wow. You gotta try that gravy, so it got a kick to it. Really goodness, really good flavor. 
really hearty gravy. Absolutely delicious, guys. Uh, <clears throat> sausage and spice. Um, let me get into the biscuit now. I said try the gravy, not the biscuit, man. All right, so when you get a biscuit meal like this, the only way to really eat it is to break the biscuit down and get little scoops of biscuit in each bite. So I'm gonna try the biscuit uh, with the eggs and let you guys know right now. Oh, trying to get the biscuit. I'm trying to get the gravy. I'm trying to get the cheese. I'm trying to get the egg. Guys, the biscuit with their house jam and the eggs and that fried chicken is just a world of flavor, guys. Mm. Guys, it's just a world of flavor. Super world of flavor. That spice, and I'm not a guy that likes spicy food. I really don't like spicy food. But this right here is just delectable. All right, guys, so I can't lie to you. The gravy got too spicy for me, y'all. I had to push the gravy to the side and just focus on the chicken and the biscuit. The biscuit, when you come here, you have to get the jam. Because without the jam, the biscuits, they're not, they're not gonna survive. They're too dry. Okay, it's gonna go, your throat is not gonna survive. That biscuit gonna hit your throat and you're gonna start choking, okay? Worse than Popeye's biscuits. So when you come, make sure you get that jam. Make sure you pick up about two of them because you're gonna need them because them biscuits is drier than my lips in the morning, okay? So, um, the chicken is just okay. Um, the biscuit is just okay, but it needs that needs that jam. The gravy for me, guys, just got in the beginning. It was good, and then it just got too overpowering, too spicy, so I cannot have it. Um, so yeah, so I'm gonna try to finish this little piece of biscuit right here, and that little piece of chicken, and then uh, come back to you guys. All right, guys, so we are done with our meals, and uh, we're gonna overrate it shortly but before uh we go outside and raid it i just wanted to give you guys one more shot of the restaurant uh beautiful uh super clean um it's one of those spots where you leave your plates at the table and i hate that because when we came to the table there's still dirty uh dishes here you know so you gotta wait for the staff to pick it up but uh uh, beautiful location, staff is super friendly, uh, place is well kept, great location here in Pembroke Pines, great atmosphere, uh, everybody's just catching the good vibe man. So again, this is the, uh, this is a shot of the place, there's even tables right around that corner, and there's tables outside, so there's a lot of seating, uh, this place gets really busy, but yeah, that's, uh, that's Maple Street uh, Biscuit Company. At a scale of one to five, what you rate it? A four. A four. Sweetheart. Scale of one to five. Three. A three. I give it a three. I give it a three. Okay, mommy gives it a three. Okay, and for the boss man, up. there's no five and a half. Man. And for the boss man, I'm gonna have to go with. God. I think I'm gonna have to go with a three. 3.5 on this one. I'm going to have to go with 3.5. Uh, thanks again for watching, guys. I'm going to end this quick because my kids and wife are in the car and they're hot. Thank you for watching this vlog. I'm going to go with a 3.5. Good atmosphere. Food was just okay. Um, thank you for watching. Like this. Subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys next time on Living with Los. Peace. Ah, le, le, ki, 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 le, 